Major one tends a disaster. Let's just start with that. State Representative Jeff Helfrich is co-chief sponsor of House Bill 2645. He hopes the state's effort will be key in addressing Oregon's opioid crisis. Nobody's using the system to be able to get the treatment that they need. And we need to have a kind of a carrot and stick theory. It's like, if you're not going to go to treatment, you're going to have to go do something else. And that something else is going to be, you know, a consequence for your actions. In Portland, police say they're already contacting community members who regularly use drugs. A representative for the police bureau tells us this law would just be another tool that they can use to try and address significant public safety concerns surrounding the use and abuse of drugs. But again, the bill only addresses fentanyl. Helfrich says he wishes the mayor would have thought twice about reining in his proposal. I think his ordinance needed to be pushed out personally, but if he wants to use this law as a guise, we'll, we'll see what happens when it goes to court because there's going to be an attorney that appeals this and we'll see what happens. And I'd hate to lose this law or at least lose law enforcement's ability to, to hold some people accountable for what's going on. The bill now goes to the governor for approval. If she signs it, it would take effect within 90 days. David. Catherine Cook reporting downtown. Thank you, Catherine.